Okay, Jimmy. Let's see if this synthetic keratin mixture works. Open it up, ye. Okay. Let this cool for a second and... Now do ye! Flexible! And super strong! Yes! We've got it! We've replicated the pangolin scale formula! That's the last bit of programming I needed for the pangolin suit. It's Chris and Martin! Tortuga, we've got a problem. It's Artichoke's mom. She's gone! <gasps> we came back and found Artichoke, but no mom. And this. We've got to save her and take care of Artichoke while we do. Well, I've got something right here that might help. A Pangolin Power Disc! Ready for action! Got it! Oh! Uh, and zap it! Oh! Got it! Aw, oh, brother! Ha! I get to test it out! Activate Pangolin Power! Awesome! I feel so powerful. Nothing can hurt me with these awesome scales. <laughs> Good thing you got to test it out. <laughs> A naked pangolin. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. I may have to adjust the scale fasteners. Uh-oh. What? A clouded leopard. Artichoke, look out! <gasps> Jimmy, quick! Teleport! <laughs> Scales, don't fail me now! Nice one, Chris! Just what a mother pangolin would do to protect her baby whose scales aren't full strength yet. Let's hope mine are... Ow! Ow! Hey, wait! It doesn't even hurt! Ha! The scales are working! They're super tough! Oh, yes! What a defense! Aviva, you did it! Whew! I was worried there for a minute. <laughs> Sorry, pal. You're never gonna get through. We can do this all day if you want. Whoa! 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 <gasps> whoa, whoa. Uh oh! Chris! I'll get you down. Wait, leave me up here. Uh, brother, I know you like to be up in trees with creatures, but we got work to do. No, listen. The only way to find Artichoke's mom and figure out who's doing this is to get into the heart of the operation. Aha, so if you stay in the trap, you'll get collected and taken right to where Artichoke's mom is. Then I come to the rescue, <laughs> as usual. Exactly. No, not as usual, but yeah, that's the plan. But Artichoke doesn't need to come on this mission. Come on, Artichoke, I'll catch you. Gotcha. <gasps> Hi. <gasps> <gasps> Gourmand. I smell a creature in my trap. <laughs> Ooh, interesting. What do we have here? A new green species? Let me have a look at you, huh? Is it... Oh, come on! Open up, Staley! Ooh. You can't just pry open a pangolin, no matter how hard you try. Nah! Oh, I'll forget it. I'll get you open back in the kitchen. The kitchen! Okay, Artichoke, let's get ready to follow that endangered species chef. Quick! To the city I sails with a boat full of pangolin scales! 
there'll be the special health booster for my smooth and juicy juicer. Yo-ho-ho-ho! -ho -ho. Surely people will believe that the scales from a creature this strange possess special health benefits. So I'll just grind up the scales as a health powder for the greatest smoothie recipe ever! Are you kidding me? Pangolin smoothie for health? No. Martin, come in. Chris here. Did you get the coordinates I sent? Got them, Chris. We're on our way. <laughs> T-Rex? <gasps> he got you too? Whoa, he's got pangolins from all over the world. Martin, hurry. The way Gourmand is collecting the pangolins, they'll be gone before we ever get a chance to tell people about them. That's not gonna happen. Trust me, I'll be bombing in real soon. Hey, I'm looking for a certain Chinese pangolin. She's the mom of a friend of ours. Can you help me find her? You? Green grape. I should have known. Huh. Who did you say you were looking for? Uh, this one, maybe? <gasps> Gourmand, let her go. Now, now, I can't do that, because then I wouldn't be able to use her in my very first pangolin smoothie. And you can watch me prepare it. <laughs> Okay, what do we know about El Cratorum? Well, we know our namesake is a bark mantid and lives on smooth bark trees. Like this one. Wow, that's a lot of bark to cover. And Litter Goose of Cratorum is only this big, just over three centimeters long, and camouflaged to blend into that bark. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Oh, yeah. I think I'm thinking what you're thinking. I think we're thinking the same thing. I think so, too. I have no idea what you two are thinking. You think you could fill me in? We won't find these mantids unless we're small. We've got to get on their level to find them. We've got to get mini-sized. Oops. <laughs> and how many times has that backfired on us? Too many. <laughs> that should do it. <gasps> Watch out! Wow! Maybe being mini and riding bus bikes isn't such a good idea. Yeah, we're like little bugs. Whoa, being mini is a pretty crazy thing to do if you're looking for a bug hunter. Yeah, tell me about it. Uh, uh oh. Uh -oh. Our praying mantis hunts bugs. <gasps> We've been found by the mantis we're looking for. <laughs> Hello, Litter Goose and Kratorum. It's us, the Krat Brothers. I'm Martin. I'm Chris, and I've heard about some praying mantises eating their mates, but not about eating the guys you're named after. Hmm, let's see what the scan shows. I wouldn't count on it. You're in the arms of a hungry predator. Nice triangular head you got there. And your eyes are big and round. Yeah, and this mantis is really long and skinny. Greenish body with brown stripes. This mantis species is a runner. Whoa! Not a sit and wait hunter. Our mantis runs down his food. Kind of like the cheetah of the mantis world. I've never had such a good view of praying mantis mouth parts. The jaw like structures are impressive. Uh, Chris, remember, you're the prey. Those mouth parts are designed to eat you. Ah! Hurry, Amoeba! Quick! Programming complete. Coming at ya! Activate Litter Goose and Gratorum powers! Wow! Litter Goose and Gratorum powers are awesome! Awesome vision! I feel like hugging a tree and running up the trunk. Ha <laughs> ha! A big old win 
for moi! Only because your hunk of junk crashed! Ugh. How much more of this can I endure? Hey! Huh? What do you think you're doing? Well, firstly, let us make sure you don't alert the Krat Brothers to our presence here. <gasps> Consider all your communications. Kaputsu! <laughs> Let's find those wild rats! That's, That's wild, wild crats. crats! Oh, whatever! They'll be wherever their new bug buddies are. Oh, the wild crats are that way! Aw, he's like the hound dog I never had! <laughs> Woo ah, yeah! Wow, Leonard Goose Kratorum is fast! Truly the cheetahs of the mantis world! Yeah! And they can stop on a dime. Uh-huh. Wow, check it out. Leonard Gusakratorum has great camouflage, too. He blends into the bark and disappears. Now I understand why we never saw them before. But they don't just hide and wait for prey to come to them. They chase it down! Whoa! to get real size. Whoa! Watch out for the bird, bros! Huh? Ah! Whoa! A tree tarantula! Cool! A turnip tail gecko! Whoa! Whoa! The life of Linergusacratorum is fast and furious. 